This first picture that you're seeing is um, a picture of myself. I'm in the middle, in the front. I was about four years old. My sister Angie is on the left, and my sister, oldest sister Marie is on the right. In the back is my cousin Johnny Vale. This picture was taken in front of my grandparents' house in Rockville, Colorado. Uh, my dolls, the dolls, I don't know where they came from or who. Uh, who gave them to us. This was probably in about 1939. In the next picture you will see is my grandparents that lived uh, live in the house in Rockville. This is my grandmother Angelina and my grandfather John Faro, F-A-O-R-O. They both came from Italy, from Genoa, Italy. Um, they came, I don't know what year, I know my mother was just a baby when they came. Um, so he was a miner. He mined coal in the, um, in Rockville, Colorado. Um, uh, he was a wonderful, joyous, jolly kind of person that loved life. And my grandmother was a very stern and, uh, very structured woman who kept everything very immaculate and she needed to have everything uh, her way. Anyway, this uh, this picture is uh, a nice remembrance of my grandparents. Uh, this photo is of my um, my mother, who is on the right hand side, and her sister Margaret, who I'm named after. Um, my grandparents had uh, two, three boys, and two daughters. The next picture you will see are two of, um, it's a very old, old picture and it's some relatives. I'm not really sure what who the relatives were, but they came from Italy. And uh, this was back, way back when they first came from Italy. The next picture you're going to see is a picture of my great uncle, uh, my uncle, he's my uncle. He, they called him, his name was Lindo Farrell, but he they called him Bear because he was always very big. He was over six foot tall. This was some of his classmates. The next picture. This is my mother. Check out the hat. Uh, my mother's on the right hand side. And uh, I don't know if that's a friend or who that is on the left, but this was when she was probably in her maybe early 20s. She lived in Rockville, Colorado. This photo is of my great uncle, Angelo. They used to call him Big Angelo because he was so tall. He was always kind of embarrassed. You'll he'll see the chair and how tall he is above the chair. He was always very self-conscious about his height. For being a northern Italian, that was pretty unusual. Uh, he, um, he liked to sit in a chair more than stand, but he was a very good-looking, handsome man. This picture is of my uncle. They called him, his his name was Murph, but they called him, his name was Jack Farrell. He's on the right-hand side. They're hunting. In high school, he was playing leapfrog with a bunch of his buddies and broke his back. Uh, they did everything at that time to try to, do, to straighten out his spine, but never could, so he had a hunchback. That's why he's so short. He had a hunchback and he had to deal with it his whole life. He was an inventor. This is a picture of my father, Anthony uh, Rizzotti Davidi, better known as Tony Davis when he came through Ellis Island. He is on the farm, which he uh, got, they gave so much land from the government to people that were farmers, so he, he was there by himself. He's probably about maybe in his mid-twenties. He was a real cowboy, he had a gun strapped to him or and had a rifle and I can remember him riding a horse and one time I was playing outside and a rattlesnake was in the, right next to me and he took a, bit, a shot and got him right the first shot, right from, from off the horse. He was a pretty independent guy, strong, strong-willed and a really good heart. Um. This was a brief summary of my mother's family and, um, and my father's side of the family 
Um, I don't know a whole lot about him. I know that his, bra his father brought him over from Italy when he was seven years old. I have a passport that shows him on the passport as a son. And uh, my father was never close to his father, and there was always some kind of friction between them. And as far as my father told me that he, uh, his mother passed away giving birth to him, and his father wasn't very nice to him. Uh, I'm still trying to find out more about the history of my father.